Hey, all you awesome students out there, just a couple quick little tips for you. And then I'm going to show you how to upload actual real handwritten work to your Google Classroom assignments. First off, hopefully you knew that when you complete an assignment, it gets kind of dimmed out a little bit. So see how everything is blue here? This is assigned. I haven't done this assignment yet, but these over here I have done. So they're dimmed out. Hopefully you already knew dimmed out means you've already done it. Now, did you also know you can view your work just straight up here and it'll show you all the work that you have to do and easily you could see this one is assigned, I haven't done it. This one is turned in, I did do it. And this one, my teacher already graded. And then look over here, I could filter it by what's assigned, that one, what's been returned, that one, and what's missing, nothing, yes. So I'm all set. Now, hopefully you also knew right here, if your teacher put a due date on your work, like a specific due date, then it's gonna show up right here because that's when your work is due. So woohoo, I have nothing due soon, but I still have this one assignment. I'm gonna click on this assignment. And let's say I actually had to write something down, like your teacher's like, turn in your math notes and you're like, how? I didn't do them on the computer, right? Not everything's going to be done on the computer. Now, of course, if I somehow had a file on my computer, I could simply add it and add that file, right? But you're thinking, no, it's a piece of paper, right? So what you're going to do is just download that Google Classroom app on your phone. If you don't have a phone, don't worry, your parents do. They could download that app. It's super easy on the phone. Let's go ahead and check this out. Once you're in this same assignment, see the same assignment, you just click right here, right down there, you know, that little arrow thing, boop, just click it, and then it's going to pop up. And this is what pops up, add attachment. Like you wanna attach something like a piece of paper, right? You're just gonna click add attachment, then you have all these options. So maybe you have a file on your phone already, maybe you already have a photo on your phone, but most likely you're just gonna hit use camera and then just line up that camera with your piece of paper. Take that little picture and it just automatically is gonna load that picture into Google Drive automatically. So now it's saved up in the cloud forever, so you're not gonna lose it. And it automatically attaches it to your assignment. See, it attached my picture right here. And then don't forget to, of course, push that turn in button right there. And then that's all you have to do. And that assignment will automatically be in your Google Classroom. You could go back to Google Classroom on your computer. You'll see it there and it's awesome. That would also work if you're doing anything on there, like even in the stream, if you needed to upload something to the stream, you could take a picture like that as well and upload it. Also, one more tip, do you have notifications set on your phone? Because you can set those notifications in there and then it will show you, you know, every time your teacher gives you a comment, a new assignment, so, I know you get notifications on your emails if you have them set up, but maybe you just wanna see a pop up on your phone and be like, ooh, new assignment, or ooh, my grade's set, and then you're all ready to go. See you guys later, have a good night.